this is really bad. I'm nearly dead. And this little apple right here is the only food I have left. I think I'm going to die here. The sun is sinking and the monsters will be out soon. And I can't reheal myself anymore. But wait, on top of that hill, could that be my house? My little wooden foot? Yes, yeah, I think it is. Quick, I can finally reheal my wounds if I can bake my pork shop. Yes, it is. Finally, just in time. Alright, hello everyone and welcome to another Minecraft tutorial. I hope you liked my little roleplay in the beginning of this video. So now let's get started. As you can see, I indeed did make a exploding furnace. The design was completely invented by myself. It doesn't use a butt switch, which is really good. And you're immediately dead if you use enough TNT. So there is no ch uh, warning chisel at all. Um, so you will be dead immediately. So let's start with the proper build. First, you're going to need a 4 by uh, 5 area. Yeah. So let's mark that place with TNT already. One, two, three. So that's a 4 by 5 area right here. And of course, you can make this deeper if you want to put flooring above your TNT, which is rather logic. So let's place a furnace here, comparator at the back side of your furnace and a dispenser facing downwards. So use the shift click technique on your comparator and place your di dispenser facing downwards like so. Place a flint and steel inside your dispenser and um, place a support block here, a rail and a minecart with TNT. Now you're going to knock out this piece of rail, place your blocks here again, and place some more TNT if you want to. Um, this TNT is really important to let your um, explosion travel to this TNT over here. So do that, and um, that's basically it. When someone puts something in this chest over here, in this furnace, I mean, it doesn't matter. It can even be a non-cookable good like that. And as you can see, it immediately blew up. So, I hope you all enjoyed. And I hope to see you guys all next time. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like, comment, and maybe even subscribe. So, I'm Blackstone Movies. And see you guys all next time. Bye bye.